Yeah, it's amazing. I was here yesterday and I'm excited to be here again in the middle of so much cool work. So my animation is called Tom Tom, and it's sort of a response to uh, the lack of human interaction that we had the two years prior in terms of, of COVID. Um, and it's also sort of, it responds to a chaotic world and I wanted to simplify the world and I wanted to create, personify uh, and visualize an internal state of being. Uh, and the best way uh, I thought of it was to create an abstract experimental animation, uh, which was heavily inspired by the screening made by Puntu and Raya in 2018 in Lisbon, uh, of the 2018 uh, winning uh, uh, projects that screened in Lisbon. And suddenly there was this wave of motivation and inspiration that came through me. And yeah, in a limited amount of time, I was able to create this really cool project. And it was the first, first time I was working with sound as well. Uh, and sort of trying to unify both the visuals and the sound. And it all came at the same time. Uh, I've heard that a lot of people create the sound first and then visualize it. But I think the chaos that, that, that it brings and the randomness and the cre just the excitement that it comes with having both happening at the same time and then changing and tweaking things is what makes it so exciting to, to create this project mainly. I come from an illustration and, anima and an animation background and I'm still in my third year of illustration uh, in the UK. And usually we work around narrative and linearity and the animation sort of responds to sort of defying linearity and just coming back and forth and forward and to the past and to the future. And it was really fun. I felt very free. Um, and yeah, I ended up creating this organism of, of visuals and shapes and form and yeah, that's it was so exciting to create. I, I kind of wanted to portray this feeling of breathing almost and the shapes move and like, and it's this just, this it's a rhythm. It's an organism that just, it's almost musical in a way. Even without the music, I feel like watching it can portray that sense of rhythm once again. <laughs>